Wolf Creek is the one that, like when you snap your friends or put it on Instagram, everyone's like, no way you're at that place. But it very much feels like a video game golf course. You're out there thinking, I can't believe this is here. And so we went into Wolf Creek. If we play well and we get the W, it's over. And we lock it up. Frankie Borelli with a beautiful golf shot. You, you don't even know what you're looking at. You're like, is this thing I'm staring at a real golf course? I was so confused by the situation. Not what really. the fuck was that? You know, you're setting this golf course up to be played to the extreme. One of the challenges is to make the course not too difficult, <laughs> really. Crazy winds, cold, rain in the forecast, just weather that nobody was prepared for. This is a probably bottom two weather day we've ever seen out here. Right before we teed off, where it was like, are we really going to do this? When you're playing a golf course like Wolf Creek, which you, everyone that's watching this, I bet you, I don't know, 60% of the people don't know it's a real course, and I'm part of that. I mean, I thought for sure it was just one of those made up golf courses in Tiger Woods that they, they always come up with these crazy fucking courses, and Wolf Creek had to have been one of them. Yeah. Most obvious, day, your birthday's over, buddy, oh. and you're just a rusty 32 years old. I felt 32. Just a who cares 32. You're dead today. We're gonna fuck you up. Mother you remember being five down through five? I remember that. I remember that for what sure. Fuck you up. I also remember somehow you peered it. Today's just that old chunk See you and later, run. Bitch. That old chunk and run trend. See you later, bitch. Yep. What a couple of losers. A couple of losers. Hey Trent, read between the lines. Oh, a couple of fucking losers. Yeah, Wolf Creek video game golf course. Everybody's played in the video game. Even the people that work there talk about how most people that they speak with, didn't think it was a real course. I learned about it from the 06 Tiger Woods game, and I never thought it was a real place until 2015, you know? And uh, you come out here and it's really similar. If you guys have played the video games, it's almost identical. We showed up to Wolf Creek um, with it in mind, where you push the first match, then you win the second, and if you win this one, you just win. But everyone's mindset changed as soon as we got there because the weather was crazy. But also, this wind's a fucking joke. Like, you're watching this, you want to come to Wolf Creek, you're watching the travel series, you want to see how we're playing it. We're obviously showing up the golf course. This is probably the worst day to play Wolf Creek out of the 365 days here. Windy, cloudy, freezing. This is a probably bottom two weather day we've ever seen out here. Okay. It was borderline unplayable. We thought about just, I, I was about to say we're not playing. I mean, they were saying the rain was going to come down. I thought the cameras were going to get messed up. It's pretty windy. It's just super windy. This is just really tough condition. Yeah. I, might, I, mean, I might shoot 300 today. I might shoot 300. We have to, have to, have to win this match on the putting game. Alright? Yeah, just if we have a four footer, it's gotta go in today. But yeah, we went into Wolf Creek knowing that if we win this, it's fucking over. We were confident. Yeah, yeah. Tell me say we're not. Yeah. Yeah, so again, confidence is high. I'm like, we're gonna beat these guys. Like the strokes today, Lurch gets one, Frankie gets six. Trent, what did I say? You get 26? 26. 26. Woo! Let's just get this thing going. Yeah. We got four hours to get this round in. It's the worst weather day of all time. This thing going. All right, all here right. comes here comes action. Play well, fellas. It's gonna play tough. It's gonna probably play one of the hardest days at Wolf. So yeah, number one at Wolf is basically a gettable par five. This super small green. Driver's gonna start downhill. Uh, you got bunker on the left and right that for a lot of players it doesn't really come in play. But your second shot's where you can really get in danger. You got water on the right, bunker on the right. Your bailout's gonna be short left. Um, it's like I said, it's definitely gettable in two. Um, and you wanna stay below the hole. And almost everyone out here you gotta stay below the hole.
Fuck, that's perfect. I'll take that if it gets out there pretty good. Yeah. I haven't missed a warm swing when my body's warm, I rip the ball. You're warm right now? I'm bubbling. You guys are falling too soon. First day, warm swing. I think you're fine over there, Frank. Huh? Well, Thank you, Frank. Yeah, once you carry this little bit of hill this here, it's, it's wide open. Awesome. Yeah, you're good. Awesome. This feels like the biggest swing I've ever seen. Unfortunately, I love Trent, but he's having a really bad day today. He's not a win player. No. Every time. Right down, right down the middle. Kick the ball, ball Trent. Oh, that's great. All right. Money. Money. I mean, drop kick. Can't see perfect. any of these I did. Balls I dropped kick. And it was perfect. I dropped kick. Can't see any of these balls land. Here we go. Freezing. <laughs> Woo! Heavy bag. said these things do not stop. Yeah, what did that mean? What does it mean they won't stop? It means there's like a go. Most people are so used to like carts now that are high tech, like we have that your governor's on. Yeah. You can rip around, and if it's unsafe, they like stop. They like oh, slow down. Oh, like it holds you. Yeah. This okay. is like it just rips. Oh man. It's a mandatory win this golf match day. Huh? Yep. talked to the superintendent and he was saying that he didn't think this place actually existed except on the video game Tiger Woods 2006. I think that's how a lot of people feel and now we're just out here and it looks like a video game. Oh no no. Zoom what? Yeah. It looks like they took not only the, the, the golf course but the rock surrounding it and just placed it there like everything was artificial. Is, is he in water? Or no, no, I think he's already. Oh, oh, I found some uh, water. Water was he? Sir, are you okay there? I'm short. <laughs> Get in his fucking head. <laughs> I want to make an up and down after a job. <laughs> I love that. He lost oh. a ball. Huh? On the water. Another one. I think that's seven. Huh? Seven, I think, for me. Lost balls? Oh. I'm at seven too. Team guys. I'm at five. Trey, how many lost balls? Uh six. No. <laughs> like does that come back onto the green? Like where does that go? What do you mean? That's just you know, sand trap in hell. What are we doing out here, Ben? It's 146. What are we doing out here? Pathetic, pathetic effort. No. But you're feeling the pressure because it's like a must-win situation, so you're grabbing the club a little bit differently. See how this puck goes, Mike. Thank you. 
Number two is a pretty short par four scorecard. Yardage is a little bit different than how it will play. When in doubt, don't grab the driver. I can tell you that right now, you won't have fun with that hole then. I think they're, they're rattling. They gotta be. They're super rattling. They have to be. I mean, the weather's rattling. I'm still hitting the ball okay. You did great. They hate that. You they just. Birdie putt. They hate that. I did have a birdie putt. They don't like when you hit it great. They hate it, which I, I understand. I would too. There's two sets of staircases going up to two. And you guys would probably just play off on the top one, but uh, they had a helicopter in the steps. Um, so to, to make this place happen, yeah, they had a helicopter in the staircases. All the bunkering you see out there, the sand's helicoptered in when they built the place. Just slice one for the love of God. No drop zone. I don't. I can't go down and come back up. I think I die. I didn't see anything. But. No, but it was over that hill. I think it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. I think that's perfect. Yeah, we're, gonna, we're gonna know a lot about where this is. Is this the hole? Is that the mower they're talking about? Yeah. Oh my god. That's the mower that they say they just keep. Oh, up how here. sick is that? Hole number two is a hole that guys in the industry have reached out to us and everywhere we go, like no one believes us that we have to store mowers under the earth basically at these locations because we can't get wheels, we can't get anything up there. Like, we have to have three to four guys carry these mowers up and then we're lucky to get maintenance once or twice a year on them. Down. We'll see if we get one lurch back. Gotta be way down. Fine. Oh, found about kidding? Yeah, right. great one. Right. I'm out of the hole. We might have been out one on the back. We need to hit better golf shots. Yeah. All right, the reason why we're down one and haven't won a hole in fucking forever, 13 years. The brakes better fold up. That's just a Ooh. Dude, I got, if I got no brakes, I get... I'm jumping out then. This is twisty turning. That's crazy. Now I know what they're talking about. I'm just signed a waiver there, Trent. What does it say is a waiver to sign away responsibility if we go flying off a cliff and die? Is that what it is? That's what I heard. It's like you go to skydiving, parachuting, and golfing at Wolf Creek. Yeah. Those are your options. It's like the same waiver. You could say it's dangerous, yeah. <laughs> it makes you pucker up every now and again. <laughs> yeah. Frank, you got a good one? Laser beam four iron and it hit the All right the thing and it bounced left towards the green. Oh, unreal. Towards the pin. But it also, we don't know what's up there. It could be a pod. Two holes, two lost balls for Rigsy. We may win a hole. We may win a hole. That's all we needed. We just needed that ball to advance. You know? Waste my stroke. Oh. Really? Yeah. Either way, whatever. It's a win. I have a stroke too, right? Obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Both awesome. We're both sitting one up here with the strokes. What a beautiful golf course. Yeah, like, really. We're rushing kind of and we're like into the. I know, field. which like, is too take, bad. Take a breath. Oh, we have to. Look what we're around them. We got to do the first two holes quick. We were like four feet short of that hole. Yeah. I'm just, you know, 
tagging along on this hole. Crazy trend is you could have just hit a drive off there and you would have been hit one off the tee. Yeah. Cause you get two strokes in this you hole. You didn't want to go down the cliff. I, I gotta tell you, I just didn't. I'm fine with that. I love that team chemistry. But we actually have rain. You can see rain from hundreds of miles away. It looks like all around us. It's horrifying. Three? Yeah. It's good, Larchie. Thanks. Back to even, Frank. We're not dead good. in this game. Back to even. <laughs> I, I agree. I'm either out this hole or out the rest of the day. So I was halfway up the stairs, and I go, I don't have a second ball, so I just, I can't go back down here. That really pulled the driver out of the back. Fine. Good plan. You too, Frank. Thank you. you. We both won the hole. Yes. Like, I won it, and yeah. you're 5-4 one. Yes. So, like, yeah. what are we even talking about? Yeah. You know? Fine. <laughs> it's all fucking <laughs> Uh, number three is an uphill par three, and it's arguably the dumbest golf hole, <laughs> dumbest golf hole ever made. The, you can't see the green from any of the tee boxes, um, even from the ladies' tee in the drop zone. It's it's a straight uphill little 85-yard flick shot, uh, but you still can't see the green. So take an extra club. Uh, you're gonna want to probably still aim for the front part of the green because once you get up there, the thing slopes back to front. I'll say it one more time: stay below the hole. <laughs> I would just really love to know what's past the hole. Is it, are we on a plateau once we get up there? Or are we just, what is it are we trying to hit it to a crap? I'm gonna play. Play the number because of the wind? Let's talk about this privately because this is, this is. This looks challenging. Back of three, 170, 20. 20, that's what I'm playing. Okay. Playing. Okay. <laughs> he got it in the air. Gotta go really high. Something where you get to hit it again is a great shot. That is a joke of a hole. The guys in the pro shop say it's like their least favorite hole in golf. Like it is a video game golf course. Um, so if you go there with any other expectation, you're a crazy person. You're gonna get rattled and you're gonna lose your mind. Off the toe into the bunker. He was right, this hole is stupid. This is too much movement. You gotta run up the hill and then come back down. It's not, a, it's not a critique, but it very much feels like a video game golf course. You're out there thinking, I can't believe this is here. Oh yeah. Really good, bud. It's cold, which is kind of rare, um, and especially uh, south wind's not very common here. So you got some of the par A cold fives. south wind. Yeah, it's a different south wind today. This is massive. This is just a huge problem. I mean, we just can't lose the double. We can't both have doubles. That's my fault. We got the ball in there, too. Oh, yeah. It's not like we were dead. Number four is uh, another short par four. This one's definitely gettable with the right line. Um, from the tee box, though, your green is hidden. It's a blind tee shot. Another layup hole. Front nine's full of layup holes. Don't be, uh, don't be afraid to keep the driver in the bag on most tee shots on the front nine.
Actually, Frank, let me go first. I'm gonna hit a drive all the green here. Driver. You want me to go driver? Or whenever you feel comfortable. Yeah, maybe a little short. Rip that fucking. I think I'm I think I'm fine. Wherever I am, I'm very happy with this one. Dude, you could have hit it all the way up there. Right, down. right. thinking there Nice to get a stroke on that one. Five is gonna be your second par five in the front. It's probably the second and only, I would say, hole that you should use driver on. Um, it's fun to go at it. There's a lot of desert you could try to carry on the left side. Um, a lot of room to, for mistakes on the right with the driver. And at that point, it's just straight uphill. Uh, take extra club on your second shot, definitely get a bull in two. Um, bailout's gonna probably be Long and right, there's a big slope in the back side of the green. If you hit that, your ball might funnel right back down to the green. So the fifth hole stepped up and just took a way more aggressive line and you hit it, you swing hard, you feel good about it, and then you just pray. You're like, please let that thing land on oh, earth. I, yeah, I think that's perfect. Did you hit that hard? Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted to hit it. We'll Where find out. I never know. I'm happy with it. Look great. You know, a it's a game of guesses out here. Yeah. Ooh, big bounce. Cards close, I'll get you one. Yeah, probably in that bunker. Alright. Flying three net two? Yeah. Right. Ball count up to eight? Yep. Alright. This is one of the biggest things I've ever seen, Jake Bath. This is one of the biggest things I've ever seen. Total guessing game where this thing fucking lands. I think you I watched your I think I'm 99 percent sure you're okay. Didn't lose my ball, I want everyone to know that. So take the go the other way on the slot machine. Oh Let's go. 
just sit. Oh my god! What the fuck? That was so deceiving. I didn't know that was gonna be enough at first. What the fuck? Dude, when I saw that hit back there, it was my <laughs> brain was <laughs> yeah, couldn't, couldn't agree anymore. I was so confused by the situation. Not what me. the fuck was that? I loved it, but it's something that I can't wrap my head around. Like, you, you don't even know what you're looking at. You're like, is this thing I'm staring at a real golf course, or is it just like a painting in front of me? I've never really experienced that, where like, you were trying to take in the views, but you didn't even comprehend what was going on. You're like, I have to play golf on this? I don't understand. We're at 600 feet in the air, like, what is happening? One time. I rolled in the putt you're not supposed to make, like a 20 foot curler that was just trying to get close for a three. So I'd be a crazy person not to say that was my favorite hole because I don't make eagles maybe once or twice a year and made an eagle there. So that's definitely my favorite hole. Down two. Gonna have to be better. It's a fantastic eagle, to be honest. It is. Like, <laughs> that's just a little fun. Look at this fucking Number six here at Wolf's a par four with a creek going down the middle of it. Uh, it's a really well placed creek. Uh, makes it very hard to get there in one. I don't think you guys will have to worry about it today. You're not gonna get anywhere close to it. Really cool little, little par four where you hit a nice little seven iron down to the fairway and probably an eight or a nine iron back up to the green. Real fun hole. Going. Come back. The strength on me to fucking stop that one. I was ready to roll. Oh, Woo! <laughs> wow. I'm gonna get practicing in here. That was a lot. It was impossible to find. It was right. Like, it was up at that bunker. Yeah, just right and short of that bunker. Yeah. Is where the line yep. Is. Well, we were booking it there, man. We were booking it. I am, my foot was on right. We were booking it, though. We were going fast, for sure. That car was making a noise. I've never heard a car make. Fuck yeah. you. Fuck 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 you. They could probably went into this water. Yeah. So I had a three iron that almost got into that water. Yeah. Okay. We were just talking about that blue X. Right there. Yeah. Beautiful little stream here. Up. Walk it out there. Oh, that shit feels good on my summer in hand. For, being, for keeping it a buck. Yeah, wow, your hand is fried. Cool. Oh, yeah. Girl. 
Crank that soldier boy. Crank that soldier boy. Come on now. That might be worse than what Keep you Keep the truly can there. If you hit the truly can, I'll give you the hole. Hit it. Oh, how does that not keep rolling? Whoa. This girl's a big putt. Yeah, we need this. Can we show you? Yeah. Frank, you're for what now? Six? Six. That's good, Frank. A little bit, right? Yeah. We're down bad, man. You know, we're down and out. Whew. We have to, have to, have to win this match on the putting green. All right? Yeah, just if we have a four footer, it's gotta go in today. We gotta get some smiles going, you know? Just to make this round fun. Ooh. Down three? That was a bad hole. And I'm tired. Seven's one of my personal favorites. It's got a really gorgeous background, especially when the sun's up. You got uh, mountains deep, deep back, and then you got other parts of the golf course kind of in the backdrop. But seven, if you're a long hitter, is one of those short par fours that's gettable. It's probably a 280 carry uh, to the green. The green's right in front of it. It's got a big cliff, water right in front. Uh, the smart play is probably like uh, some of our other holes in the front. Seven iron, and then you got a little wedge, probably 125, 100 yards in after you hit easy, just lay up, lay up off the tee. We, we just gotta get positive about what's going on. You know, it's been lackluster. What happens over this hill? Because it went over the hill. Oh, you're good. Go, go. This thing's gonna run all the way down. <laughs> go, you go. I think it's cutting a little crap. Yeah, it's gonna be a little. All right. Left on that one or what? Oh, you cock. Help me it's in that bunker. Be sure. Just, no, don't have a horrible right down. Huh? Yeah. yeah. All right, all right. Get a good sand shot. So fucking stupid. God. Heads up. What's up? <laughs> Did you hit him? Anywhere near me? I don't think what so. I don't know where it went. I don't know where it went. I'm just such a fucking asshole. That's it the first time. It was a big shot. Yeah. Be good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Put a lot of pressure on him to get a good shot. Let's go, Frank. Come on. He's got to get over this fucking nastiness. Yeah. Oh, Look at that. Oh, Trent. Oh, wow. Good piece on that waiver. That's not me. Now you're just an idiot looking for his ball. We're talking lost ball counter, which we did on this Vegas trip. This is the one where I lost the majority of my balls. I just, I didn't have it. You gave me your best, Trent Daddy. I'll meet you down there. It's a shame. Yeah. I don't want to chunk this and go in the ocean. No, go and get something nice. I'll keep going to an ocean, it's a pond. Yeah, that's fine. I lost my ball. 
thought it was going to be one of those on the hill, and then it just wasn't. Nice, you know? nice little feet, though. Thank you. I got pretty good balance. Huh? I mean, I got a big, stocky frame. Low center of gravity. So, yeah, low center of gravity. Hard to knock me over. Red Rover, Red Rover. I'm a king at that game. So, yeah. Good one. Four. Thank you. All right. Three down sounds better than four down. 100%. Number eight's a nice little par three. From the tips, it's a really good par three. From our normal everyday play, the, our, our normal everyday tees, it's a pretty pretty fun one. You got water on all three sides. Bailout's not really there at all. Uh, short little approach on it, but yeah, you got water on all three sides and desert canyons. When, this is a whole wind's gonna be hitting you in all angles. Everywhere you look, wind's coming. Should get a two on a part three, but I think it's the hardest hole in the world. It better be. I'm getting one on a part three, so. Oh yeah. I believe I can drop on that sliver, right? No. Cross that. Yeah, across the floor. All right, Benjamin Severance. Yeah. Just one little ball in the green. Nope. Just one ball in that green circle. 130 yards away. Put this ball on that green. Good. Good. Down ball. Get down. Down. Great shot. Thanks. Bye-bye, ball. It's been fun. <laughs> I've had a lot of fun with you. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. Yeah. Hit, hit that ridge. Hit that ridge nice and soft. Okay. Trickle. Tried to. Yep. Uh, Tried to come down soft. <laughs> You know, I'm getting strokes on like par threes. I need to fucking figure out how to win holes. So I will give Lurch the benefit of the doubt that I just, I couldn't step up. Wow. Whoa. What were you thinking there? I thought I could bounce. Did I hit that ball? No. Why? Because you're not gonna be able to hit that ball. No? Water break? Yeah. Um, so we got a, my ball right here and mini rocks. Just about as many rocks as you could possibly imagine. Might break my club. That would suck, but we'll see. Try, you can always just take it unplayable. I'm gonna hit it. Love it. We're up three. I love it. House money, buddy. Go for it. I don't know. I do it. Keeping your ball counter down, my man. That's the ball, baby. That's mine. <laughs> Quick pick. <laughs> Hold on. You guys are on the right. Right, right. Oh, butter. No, he's on the green. Great shot, Trent. Oh, fuck on. you. Come on. Water? You know, I, I hate playing bucket list courses and not playing well. I hate it. Of course I make a two. <laughs> oh, no you don't. It's good. <laughs> no, is that no, good? Oh yeah, yeah, that's good. Nice. Down two going to nine. Down two going to nine. Make this a I one hole match on the back win. nine. Let's win eight. Let's win nine. Also, I bought the fucking place out of candy bars so Trent can't get his sugar up again. <laughs> Fucked up. <laughs> Number nine, uh, you got a little bit of a carry over the pond. Again, like most holes in the front, it's okay to not pull out driver. If you are a big stick, it is gettable, kind of like seven. Nine sits up on, the green sits up on a perch. You got a big lake on your left, and on the right, you got a big cliff full that just goes right back down uh, to some desert. So if you're gonna hit stick, big stick off the tee, and you don't hit the green, 
Nah, it's, you're probably in a world of hurt. I can't believe how close you came to that fucking marker. That marker was never in your sights? No. Middle piece, middle piece. Middle piece? Fairway. Fairway? Yeah. Trent, can we talk about the burn mark on your right hand right He's there? Got some, yeah. some, some chance. I forgot to put it on the first day we were at Pebble and I've been battling it all week. Oh my word. You got that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> You're bad. You're bad, actually. But that's. Look at. See how long it comes to. Come oh, on! Oh. Come on! <laughs> what an asshole. It takes kind of an attitude adjustment a little bit about, you know, you're setting this golf course up to be played to the extreme. You know, there's people have expectations, they have, you know, these ideas and thoughts of what they're going to come out and do. And the hardest part, and honestly, in a way, like our job is to make that happen, hit that standard. So. Like that. Yeah, real nice. There you go, Fred. Yeah, no, you might be chipping up or you might be putting. I don't know. That's that was, a good that swing, was a good though. Swing. It was a much better tempo. Yeah, better for sure. Look good. Look good. Fucking Riggs is just tapping birdies. He's on his game right now. I finally hit a good shot. I'm putting for birdie. Look at him. Fuck. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I played well. I played very well on uh, at Wolf Creek. Work for me. Sit now. Oh my god. No good. Come on, man. What? Dude, it was all the way up here. Started trickling down, and then it caught this other ridge, went all the way down the street. One of the challenges is to make the course not too difficult, <laughs> really. You get out there, we can get the greens rolling 12 and a half, 13, but nobody would ever hold a green. You know, you hit a spinner in at 13, you're gonna be 75 yards down, back down off the approach, especially on a windy day like you guys got. to get it further. No, I mean, I, if you didn't want it to get it further, then I would question really everything about you. I mean, come on, man. Real. That would have been so good. Number 10 is arguably one of the longest par fours I've played. Long carry, it's all uphill the entire way. You have a pond you gotta carry from the get go, but then it, two green side bunkers make it a difficult five or six iron in. Hit him with a whoa, T Daddy. Whoa, yes, Trent. All right, great swing. Thanks, Thanks. TBD. Right. Might have sat in Wolf's Creek. Yeah, ride the path. That'll be good. If I'm in another bunker, I'm gonna fucking jump mm. in the creek. Mm. Mm. I mean, come on, bird. 
break the shaft on it. <laughs> Rigsy, I'm on the green. Can I take a drop over there? Yeah. You're out. You're out. All right. With two. With two, it's a great shot. Woo. I almost died. But then probably my number one memory is actually when we had the drone up and there was like a medical emergency. <laughs> that was a bit walking up that hill. That was a bit. Yeah. Okay. What are the odds of that? <laughs> Fuck. Medical emergency. Imagine. It's a medical first. Imagine if this had been around where you did edibles. Like that moment right there would have just sent me off the cliff. <laughs> a, a very panicked voice on top of the hill to the right says, hey man, if you're flying a drone, you're gonna have to take that thing down because we got a medical emergency going on right now and we're trying to get a helicopter in the air. And it was just a very surreal experience. We were flying a drone, getting some shots. Frankie's got a pop here. I thought he was in a better spot. Probably shouldn't have picked up, but. Frankie Borelli. Go. That's professional. Go in. Do Go it. in. Do Go it. in. Go in. Oh, oh, you mother bitch. <laughs> Whatever, that's a 4-3. Yeah. Two to get no, out right there. Fucking... No, you can keep hitting it. No, no, no. There's no point. That, bir that bird's no getting out. I don't get it. It's like the fucking tilt. I don't understand it. Dude, that red rock shit is fucking awesome. And then we watched the helicopter take off. <laughs> it's crazy. Like, how is it not? Go, how is it the one? Like this, it's not enough power. Look. It's the same power. There you go. Badass. There you go. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's low to the ground. Look at him. See ya. He's gone. All right, match that too. Great hole, Frank. What a sick shot that was. Number 11 is probably the second longest uh, par three out here, but it plays straight downhill. So it's about the same distance on the scorecard as number three. Um, but it drops. It's straight downhill into a fun little canyon. It's a fun shot to hit. Probably drop. If you think you're gonna hit a seven, you're actually probably gonna hit a nine. If you're gonna hit a five, you're gonna hit your seven iron down there. It's a fun place. Hit some shots. Two steep bunkers on the left. Yeah, probably the easiest green out there too you'll find. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a hold one. You are? Yeah. Yeah, I think I am. Do it. Okay, I will. Yeah, it might be. Oh, yeah. Kick yeah. forward, kick forward. Good shot. Good shot. Good shot. Good shot. Big bounce. Oh, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> I was wrong. I was wrong. Stamina becomes an issue for me. Um, I couldn't tell you the last time I played four or five days of golf right in a row. Um, I've been sitting in my New York City apartment for 
13 months straight. So it's good, man. It's like a birdie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going to hit a good shot. Right. Let's make a birdie. I'm losing balls at a high rate now. What's your count? 10. It was 6 when the day started. So yeah, stamina becomes a factor. Um, you just, when you lose it, you lose it, and you get discouraged, and you're cold, and you're tired. Yeah, stamina and endurance were definitely an issue. No, that thing just gave out on me. Jesus. Who did we sign those fucking waivers? <sighs> All right, Frank, you almost lost me there, Jake. I'm okay. You asshole. Dude. That's good. Uh, down to one? Down one. Now we're down one. You hear that camera? Now we're down one. Oh. Yeah, clap it up. Clap it up. Now it's about getting the even. Yeah! <laughs> Dude, let's win this fucking match right now. Dude, let's win this match. Just yes. Look, blue skies. Yes. We're warm. Yes. We're going up the plateau. It looks yes. like a nightmare over here. Nightmare. Let me show you guys the sky real quick. Yep. Look, turn this thing. Look at what we're looking at. Oh, oh baby. Oh, oh, holy shit. But look to the right of us. Oh, no problem. Blue skies, but no, sir, not Beautiful this place. Places. Number 12, probably our most photogenic hole in the golf course. It's a pretty long, a long par five, skinny fairway, water on the left side, the entire length of the fairway. As usual, that Nevada desert on the right side comes into play, a lot of shots. Uh, one thing on that one, don't be afraid to aim at the desert on your tee shot. We stop mowing grass on 12 as to act like a, a buffer for the ball. Just otherwise that ball, every ball into the pond. So we, you'll see it there, you'll see these buffer strips there. You might, you might hit a 400 yard drive on that hole today. At your back downhill with, with dormant grass. What is this about? Par five, water down the left. <laughs> I couldn't tell. <laughs> How much room though on the right do we have? Is it just hitting at those mountains on the right? So I think I'm short of the rock. So is that where we're aiming? So I don't know, but like, I would guess you're fine if you're short of that shit. I just see a splash from where we can see, but I'm sure it's on the church down there. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, perfect. Yeah, not a key. All right. Think there's any chance you're safe? No. None? I mean, unless the water starts way deeper than we thought, but no. This dormant grass, look at this. It's just, look, it's all oh, yeah. to here. It's going dude, that's why I think we're dead, too. I think Rich is in any trouble. Look at that cliff, dude. It has to be so far right. They might both be in the water. You know what I mean? Oh my See my ball way out there on the right-hand side, short of the tree? I'm money. Dude, they're dead, both of them. You're right here. Let's go. You're Let's right fucking here? go, yes. Let's fucking go. Tell me they're dead. They're dead, dude. You sure this isn't right? This is me. Holy shit, they may be dead. They're dead. How do we get over there? You're fine? Uh, I'm fine. You guys are all dead. What do you mean? What? Look at those clouds, man. It looks like Jesus, lightning. Jesus, how pretty is this, dude? It looks like lightning, though. Yeah, no Have you ever seen two different fucking worlds? Riggs and Frankie and Trent all get up and they're about like all like 20 yards left to me. And they were like, they all were like throwing little temper tantrums that they all were in the water. And I was like, you're just in there. Like there's no other place that you could be. Like there's a hole and there's big water and everything funnel, you're just in the water based on where my ball is.
Frankie Borelli with a beautiful golf shot. Oh, wow. Buddy. It looks great. That's seven. We are in one. They, they thought they had good balls, but they didn't. They went into the water, and that's going to piss them off until no end. All right. Yeah, it's gonna run, Trent. Love that. Yeah. Um, those are some of the darkest clouds I've ever seen. That's crazy. Is it raining right over there? But then I had an opportunity, and then what do I do? I think I, I. No. Shit. Oh my. It's in the water. Oh, well, we're back, Trent. Swimming. Top one left into the water with a three. -wheel. It's like I suck, um, and that's just the nature of golf, honestly. Put a lot of pressure on yourself right now. Me? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're pressing for like no reason. You're pressing. You're pressing. Yeah, I know. I, I, like just play your game. It is a battle of who can just suck the last. Frankie Borelli, do I love you so much? Come on. Do me. I love you so no, no, much? No, sit, sit, sit. It's gonna be fun. Oh yeah, come back, come back. I played like shit. I played fucking terrible that day. Um, there's gonna be stretches of this video that people are watching right now where I completely disappear. You guys stay dry? No, I did not. What's it really like? You like four? I like four. Strength wise, four. I think I like six. I'm gonna bask my head right, I like six. Go in. Go in. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh! Doesn't matter. <laughs> Let's go. Great putt. Thank you. What's up? What'd Great. you make? One better than you. I don't know. So Great putt. We're, we're four up. <laughs> I made a five. Oh. Okay. This is an all star match. This is an AS match. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. You know, they had battled back to get it to even, uh, and they had a bunch of momentum, and they, that's, that's when they, they were trying to find it. They were really scraping, and, and they came up with a little bit of energy. Something dick nasty. Yeah. You're about to. You know what I mean? Woo! <laughs> what a putt. You feel that? What a putt. You feel that? What a putt. <laughs> The last little trickle. Oh, <laughs> beautiful. Yes. Beautiful. Yes. 13. 13 is kind of crazy. <laughs> on the game, on the video game, 13 is the one you can hit over some canyons, and that's the one you always try to hit basically a flop driver over a canyon onto a tight green to the right. In real life, it's not that easy. You're looking at a basically that's it. You're looking at a flop driver going 280. And, uh, but in real life, you should just kind of hit a hybrid left side. It's a, two, it's a split fairway, um, big, wide, fat first fairway. Then your second fairway is just a tiny little approach going up to a green. And that one, I promise, if you hit a spinner into it, um, it's coming back at least 75 yards down. What is on the other side of this, like, rock? Bunker in the green. Okay. So, Frank, I'm going on the edge of the, uh, edge of the canyon. That could be okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Beautiful. Right in the middle of the fairway. Perfect. Oh, yeah, on top of that. Oh, you're good. 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 Oh, I think that could be good too. I heard the noise. I heard a noise. Yeah, hit the on the other side of it. Fuck. Playing like shit. 
Brace should be on the green for sure. Yeah. I think so. Up to you. you sure? Yeah. Off the tee, I would just lose balls. There were just a lot of holes where I picked up my ball and I was like, you gotta carry us, Riggs, because I'm having a bad, bad day. moment where those super was saying on 13 you come up a little short it'll roll 75 yards back and that one I promise if you hit a spinner into it um, it's coming back at least 75 yards down Number 14 is uh, another par four where elevated tee box, it's arguably the highest point on property. Easier to get to though than number two, but nice pretty sweet split fairway. Looks really good with the paint and dormant Bermuda down the middle. I'm telling you, there's going to be parts of this video where I just disappear. You're going to see me in the background. I'm going to have my hood up. I'm, I'm going to have, probably have my buff on, but just because my face is freezing. Just need you to warm up a little bit, big man. Yeah. A little uh, sugar. Oh. Yeah, it just was not my best performance. That's what I'll say. Riggs, Riggs played great, and you need him on a day like that when I'm in pocket for like 35% of the holes. I think people, you know what I think? I think people lie about West Coast weather. That's what I think. I think they're liars. Everyone's like, oh, out West, it's so nice and hot and warm every day. It's fucking freezing. I feel like everywhere I've been. That's what I get.
There was a couple fun points in the match where I had some real opportunities to like take a lead. And then I think I had like a three foot putt to keep the match going. And I like missed that by a mile that was over and you know, Riggs is an idiot, and so he probably should have given me that putt, but you gotta expect to make everything, and so. You know, I wasn't the best teammate either. Got stroke in this hole, couldn't make anything happen. But the big man couldn't get it done. I couldn't get it done. 15's your last par three coming in. Uh, very short, fun wedge shot. Uh, again, kind of like some other holes out here, they're all photogenic, but you got a great backdrop. You got 12 in your backdrop, you got um, mountains even further behind that. Um, it's going to be about an 85 yard shot. You can hit a spinner into it. Watch out for your miss left though. Steep, deep bunkers. A big drop on the left with the, in the desert. I would say that's, that's on me on several occasions. One, I told Frankie to rip him with a strong bad decision by me. Then I regrouped. Played the hole nicely, really, yeah. when you think about it. Yeah. Had a binker to knock it in. I missed the finger. I mean, would you expect the other guys to give that to you? Yeah, you would. Yep, yep. And then Trent reemerged in a very clutch moment on a par three and just hit a short iron to about 15 feet. We didn't have it. I mean, it's Wolf Creek. The wind was fucking 50 miles an hour. I mean, Riggs played phenomenal. It's one of those things where we all wanted to have an excuse about the wind and the bad weather, but one person in the group was playing well, so you really couldn't use that, that excuse. But I'm still gonna hold on to that excuse that the wind was just too much. We can't finish, you have the hole? We can finish, it's, I'm playing 18. If they want to in front of the entire internet, be like, oh, it's too dark, even though we're three down with three to play. That's their prerogative. Uh, hey, breaking news, I have a fucking mental problem, all right? Like, I can't keep my shit straight, and when I got wind blowing through one ear hole and the other ear hole, what do you think's happening to me? You think I'm sitting up there being like, oh, it's, everything's fine, we're just gonna fucking hit a golf ball straight and everything. No, I'm like, holy fuck, I'm not even able to get through this swing. Uh, my back swing's gonna stop because the wind's blowing in my face, the wind's blowing from the left to right, is my butt crack showing because now the wind's blowing my pants too tight, or my tits showing because now my nipples are hard. That's all I'm thinking about when I'm up there. That's what's going on in my head as I'm on the fucking tee box. And you think I'm gonna hit a good golf shot? Get the fuck out of here. Give me just like, I want to play in like a vacuum. I can't play out there. I did love Wolf Creek though. I don't want to take anything away from that. That place is fucking phenomenal. I just played horrible. Desperate team. You're down one match, you're three to, and you're two down. With, with three, no, four to play? Four to play. said about us looking for the ball. It's bullshit because he didn't give flirts that putt. That's vindictive. That's low class. That's scummy. Gotta let this match go on, especially when your partners get 27 strokes. It's just tough. How do you not turn? Lagged it up there close and canned it for a three net two to rip their hearts out. Great hole. Feels good to be back. Yeah, you are so bad. Feels good to have rejoined the video. <laughs> rejoined the video at Wolf Creek. Feels good. What a time to do it. You know, I was just wandering out there for a while, now I'm back. So, my guy was clutch when he needed to be clutch. Number 16, par four. Uh, what you see is what you get on that one. It's probably the most straightforward hole on property. Uh, nice big fairway downhill again. Green complex is totally in view. 
Uh, there's a there's a bunker right in the middle of the approach that you'll have to put it over, but uh, it's 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 a good looking hole too. And we just, we kind of just kind of fizzled out. Dude, that's insane. You hit it right down the middle of the fairway. I watched it bounce. I yeah, it got over, right? Yeah. Well, shit. Hey, just hit yours. Let's keep it moving. We won the jackpot. Great play. You played well. Great play. It was deflating because I was like, man, we just every time we had an opportunity, we just blew it. Did it. Yeah, yeah, I definitely yeah, I played a big part, I think. I wish I had played better in our, you know, series clinching match, but Riggs carried us. Hey, we, were, oh. we avenged it. We did. We avenged it. Yep. You know, we didn't need the fourth day for the jackpot because we, we just won. Uh, it's now one to one. They won Australia. We won Vegas. Yeah. It's been cold. It's a tough, it's a tough golf. Is it always this cold this time of year here? I probably should have researched this. Yeah, we didn't look it's, into it's it. It's been cold and it's been hard, but but windy. It's you know that's golf. We got yeah. we got to play better. The, the coldness and the wind doesn't affect us hitting two foot across the pot. Oh. And that's both of us. I mean, all week. Seventeens downhill par five. Uh, tee shot's gonna be down a cliff. Not sure the actual drop, maybe an 80, 80 foot drop down to the first fairway. And then once you get down to that first fairway, it's split kind of in three, three different areas. Um, it's definitely gettable in two, but you're looking at hitting onto basically an island green. You got water in front, water on the right, water in the back. Smart play to be driver. A uh, little eight, nine iron to the second fairway and then wedge right up on the green. I got a proposal. What? Me and Frankie take you two on tomorrow. Sure. I don't know if we've ever played you. I love it. I need to switch to YouTube. To the practice. Turn that shit on. <laughs> Turn that shit on. Turn that damn camera off. Turn that shit off. Turn that shit off. Turn that Eighteen is a par four where on a normal day it's a hole you guys can get some strokes made up on. It is a gettable green. Uh, however, days like today, you got you got water in the front. You got a creek with a nice, pretty waterfall on the left. Really good green complex. Seat bunkers on the side of it. Great Fun finishing hole. Yeah. That's it, man. <laughs> Who knows it? what the fuck we shot here? Rig played well. The match is over. The tournament's over. Yeah. Wolf Creek's awesome. It's just don't come right now. Don't like come this on the time. worst day I mean, in decades. And that's not saying anything about that about the golf course. No, the fucking fine. superintendents were like, why are you guys playing today? They said they thought we were going to show up late and just film a couple things for content and leave and not play. Really cool golf course. Congratulations yeah. to these two. Yeah. Thanks, fellas. Appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, very cool golf course. Wild. It's just not the right time to play. You can't play in 50 mile an hour wins. And you can't play, I mean, I mean, Riggs played well, but we all didn't.